Hello, hello and welcome back to the channel and today we've got a 2021 Lexus UX 250H Sport behind me. Uh, this is kind of a first impression, first view of the car, just picked it up about half an hour ago and thought I would give you guys a quick tour of the car just to kind of show you first impressions. So, first thing I noticed is we've got the new Lexus spindle grille. It's all blacked out because we've got the Sport package. I've got the new lights. A bit like my dad's CT. Around the side we have these blacked out kind of high gloss alloy wheels. They are 18 inch for anybody curious. I think this is celestial blue paint but I'll need to find out. Uh, I like the kind of the black arches around the wheel arch just to kind of make it look a bit more off-roady. I'll go ahead and jump on the inside. You can see we've got Lexus UX on the floor mats. We've got all this cool pattern on the seats. The dash design is a bit more modern in comparison to the IS 300H over there. I do like the fact we've got these kind of door handles that are uh, almost French style. I don't know how else describe it. They do feel a little bit cheap and plasticky, but not quite cool. In the back of the car we've got seating for technically free but however I'd probably say two at most and as you can see there's not much leg room but we get into that in full review. Again we don't handle. Again Lexus haven't put any door bin pockets there which is a bit of a shame. Go for a cap, room the back. I do like this bar light that lights up at night. Again got the blue hue in the bag to let you know it's a hybrid. Lexus UX250H and to open the boot there's a little button right under here and reasonable size boot space I did find the load height load, the lip the load height a wee bit high we do have a little bit of storage underneath and this is your cargo cover which I hope does the job just looks a little bit kind of Flimsy. I'll have a quick look at the driver's side. So get an instrument gauge there. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the quick look at the Lexus UX 250H. I'll get more out to you guys once I have took more time with the car and get a good chance to do a proper review on it. So stay tuned for the next video.